What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be doing a spring try on haul for you guys. I have stuff from Princess Polly, from H&M, Abercrombie. We have shoes, we have bags, we have all the good stuff. So let's get into it. Right, let's start off with Princess Polly. So first thing I have is this cute little black skirt and I've been really liking the mini skirt trend again. Um, not the micro mini, that's not for me. I don't feel like I have the body type for that either. But the skirt thing I can get with, especially when, like this one, it's a skirt in the back too. I'm not the biggest fan of when it's like shorts in the back. I just think it's not very flattering on me and it looks a little bit like back when I was like eight years old and we wore skirts like that. But it may just makes it so much more comfortable to wear a skirt to have shorts underneath. Um, I like the little slit detail. It zips up the side and um, I'll have all the links to everything if I can, you know, if everything's still in stock, I'll link it. If not, I'll link um, similar products and the size that I get them in as well. But I, it's super cute, super flattering. Um, love it. It's really comfortable too. And then I also got this um, long sleeve, this tank that I'm wearing underneath just for, you know, <laughs> not to show everything is from Amazon. I'll link it too if you guys want it. But um this little number I thought would be really cute. It has like cute bell sleeves. I will say this was advertised as white or cream on the website. It's definitely like a really, really pale yellow, but um, it's got like a crinkly kind of material and I thought it'd be really cute. It's really lightweight to do that whole like half tuck kind of thing in your jeans or even a skirt like this. I also think it'd be cute to kind of knot it up and do something like that. Um, Next thing for Princess Polly, um, and here's that Amazon tank again, um, are these trousers. Now, I have been obsessed with trousers for the past, like, year and a half or so, and when I saw this color, I just thought it was perfect for spring. Um, I actually bought these in, these are the Archer pants, and I got these in black, and I think all the colors they come in black and a gray as well, like a charcoal gray. They're so comfortable. Again, really really flattering um you know don't have any pockets or anything there but they do have actual pockets you can stick your hands all the way into you know ladies we appreciate that but they are like a wider leg at the bottom um but they fit so nicely I can't and the material is really nice it's not too thick not too thin so we love it and this blue color I'm obsessed with, you know, especially with the spring right around the corner and you could wear these on Easter or something with a cute little blouse, like, I don't know, just super cute. The things I got from Princess Polly are accessories, so unfortunately I did check recently and this bag is no longer on their site. It's so cute, so I'm kind of bummed that it's not for anybody that would want it, but I'm going to link some other, um, some similar ones down below for you guys in the description box, but love this bag it's such good quality it fits quite a bit in there too so um and i also like that it has some structure to it makes it nice and it just kind of stands up on its own the other thing that i know these are really popular in general but these are the bellini urson boots and i know these come in multiple colors on their website but um i got these on princess polly and they're st i don't know like I am not like a huge western wear person but we all know that western wear has been really in lately and I just think these are really really cute they're super comfortable on as well and they go with so many things so definitely grab these if you like them because they're adorable on as well all right so this next outfit is from Abercrombie the whole entire thing and this top is not normally something I would grab but I just thought it would be really cute to wear like on a date night or if you have something fun and like spring summery to go to, you go to the beach, I don't know. Um, and then I don't own a pair of white jeans so I thought I would try these and we all know that everybody loves the Curve Love fit and so these are hair, the Curve Love um, 90s straight ultra high rise. I get mine in a 28 six regular oh, really really cute and um just have like a straight leg down which is nice and i'm five four five five <laughs> i don't really know one of those and these hit like right at the bottom of my foot so if you're any taller than me 
and you want them to be full length, I would say you might want to go with the long version of these. So anyway, really cute. I like regular though so that they hit at the right spot even if you're wearing like heels or something like that. So this next item is a little bit random, I know. It's a unitard or um, a romper as some websites call it. This one is from Girlfriend Collective and um, the quality of this is just insane. It's so nice and like has a little bit of compression but not so much that you're like suffocating. Um, and we love that it has no front seam, ladies, you know. Um, and then in the back it has like a little bit of a crisscross kind of detail. And you can actually, this romper, you can, um, they have another one that's like a tank top kind of vibe on the top, which I really want to get that one too. But, um, the thing that I love about it is it has a built-in bra as well. So that's always a plus, right? Then I don't have to wear a bra. Um, and... The thing I love about Girlfriend Collective is that they are sustainable, so we love that. Every brand should be working towards that, right? Um, but I also just ordered one from Aritzia, so um, follow me on Instagram to find out which one I like better, but yeah. Um, and then how I would style this is throwing like a blazer on over this or a little button up and leave it open, a little jacket. Um, and this blazer is from H&M. I love that it's a little bit longer, especially to wear it with things like this. It covers the booty, but um, love this blazer. It's so comfortable. I can't explain, like the material is so buttery soft. And I usually, it's a helicopter. Um, I usually cuff the sleeves. It just adds a little detail, you know, but we love. And you could definitely hike these shorts up or pull them down if you want them a little bit longer. I kind of like them in the middle. But again, it's just super flattering and comfortable to like run around and do errands. We're going to go to Urban Outfitters because um, I only have one thing from them. And then we'll hop back to H&M. But I got this t-shirt. I've been wanting this shirt for a long time. Again, I'm not like super into Western wear or anything. Um, not that this is Western necessarily, but usually how I see it styled, it is. But... Um, this shirt sells out really fast. I'm not really sure why. I guess everybody wants a Woodstock shirt. This is a t-shirt dress. And for me personally, I would not wear it just as a dress. I would wear it over something like this or just with bike shorts. Um, because y'all can see how short it is. Like, my girl is right there and then my booty cheeks. Like, are you, no. For me, not long enough. But how cute is this, right? Super comfortable, lightweight. I live in California, Southern California, so we need things to be nice and cool. Um, and I would even throw on those boots from Princess Polly, and it would be super, super cute and comfy, but we love it. I am all about comfort, if you can't tell. Um, and oversized t-shirts and bike shorts are my jam. I don't care if they go out of style, I'm probably still gonna rock it, so. Anyway, all right into H&M. We have a couple more t-shirts. So this one is not oversized. This one is and so I'll show you guys. I like the vintagey look of these and I really kind of gravitate to anything UCLA related because my grandpa um, went there and so it just holds a place like near and dear to my heart. So here's another one and this one just has like that vintagey kind of vibe to it. Again, lightweight, comfortable. I mean, this would be a really nice, like, sleep shirt, too. But super cute. And then this one with the cute little Bruin on it. This one reminded me of a shirt that uh, there's, like, a photo of me in when I'm a baby. So it has, like, more of that 90s Bruins look. Again, this one's not oversized. I mean, it's not super fitted either. But this one's cute to crop like this and just tuck it under your bra and wear it like that so we love that I have these joggers from H&M and I definitely could have gone down to a size small but it's okay I kind of like that they have a little bit of like a looser fit on me these are nylon joggers they're in like an olive khaki color they have a cool little like cinching detail right here which makes them a little bit more snug 
on your waist, which is nice. And these hit me right at my ankle. So again, if you're taller than me, they are going to hit higher, obviously. This little black kind of like slinky, I guess it's not slinky because slinky is normally silky material, but um, this like cotton ribbed dress and it's a midi dress on me. Uh, hits like in the middle of my shin. Really cute. Um, just very, very simple. I'm wearing the romper underneath just so I didn't have to throw undergarments on, but um, super cute, really affordable, such a nice piece. It's not see-through at all, so, and I think they have this in a couple other colors as well, like, I think they have it in gray and white, maybe. I like to wear this to work and just throw on, like, a little blazer or a little jacket with it. The last item from H&M is this dress. And again, it's like a ribbed kind of like, so, I mean, it's not a sweater material, but it reminds me of a sweater. Um, it's definitely a good like transitional piece. I don't think I could get away with wearing this in the summer in California. I would die of a heat stroke, but I'm being dramatic, but it's really cute. Very flattering. Okay. So the last two things are just little random accessories. This little shoulder bag is from Amazon. It's really good quality for the price. I want to say it was only like $23 or $25 and I've seen them go on sale all the way to like $20 at random times. It has a decent amount of space in it as well. Um, it is still, it's much smaller than that Princess Polly one and the handle's a little bit shorter, but I think it's super cute and it comes in a bunch of colors. I want to say it comes in like 10 or 12 colors. It also comes with like a little thin chain so if you wanted to wear it as a crossbody you could um and I think some of them depending on what color you get have like a pearl kind of attachment not my vibe but you know if it's yours and it's just a really cute simple handbag um it looks more expensive than it is and it's super super trendy so you don't have to break the bank to get something that's a little bit trendier if you want and then the last thing is another pair of shoes and don't sleep on Target, okay? Because I get a lot of basics from Target, like tank tops and stuff that I wear all the time. And sometimes they, they have really good shoes and they do last a decent amount of time, I would say. But I thought these were super cute. They were only, I think $25 or something and super comfortable. Um, I'm not like a huge heel person. I like to wear sneakers, but these... I can I can do <laughs> so they have a cute little chunky heel I could even wear these at work honestly and a little two strap thing and they do have some elastic um and stuff I got mine in a seven and a half I normally wear an eight but they only had a seven and a half and they fit perfectly so I don't know you could get away with going a half size down but um they also have these in a nude color and I think the nude has um like a nude strap and a white strap and then I believe they have them in like a wickery oh uh, what's like a woven heel as well so anyway I'll link everything like I said down below but that is it that was my big spring haul I have some more stuff coming in the mail so make sure to follow me on Instagram to see how I style all of these pieces and um, how I wear them throughout the different seasons because I like to get things that are versatile that I can wear all year round. So yeah, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button for me, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Thanks for watching.